Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, got a cool idea. Since my name is Darren Waldo, uh, Eric Allen from uh, Allen's Dirt the Game gave me an idea. He said, uh, I need to show up to the track and play. Where's Waldo? What track am I at? So here's the track. And now I guess you have to uh, guess what track we're at. Uh, I'll give you a couple seconds. And three, two, one. We're at Western Kentucky Speedway in Nebo, Kentucky, just outside of Madisonville. And uh, we're here to uh, show you guys some awesome racing here in the Midwest. Uh, there's a lot of tracks in this region that run Saturday nights. And this is, this is one of several tracks. And uh, it's a pretty well-known track. It's, it's been around for quite a while. And uh, some good banking. And tonight, they, uh, the Modifieds are the top class here. The Modifieds are running for $1,000 to win. And uh, they have a special guest appearance. Uh, NASCAR's Kenny Wallace will be here. Uh, Kenny Wallace's hauler. Um, he may have been uh, big time in NASCAR and all that, but uh, he doesn't. He doesn't go all out for like the huge total homes and stuff. And uh, I know he spends a lot of his time relatively close to his house in the Midwest, so uh, he doesn't need the big the big deal. And uh, so he is just showing up. He's on the ground. So here's where we'll be shooting from tonight. So hopefully uh, it'll be a good place to shoot from. People won't be too rowdy around me and I'll be able to get a good clean uh, shot of the races. So we'll uh, probably catch up with Kenny here in a little bit. I'm sure everybody's gonna wanna be around him and all that kind of stuff. It's usually how it happens, but there really isn't. It's pretty early. I got here really, really early today. Um, they're still doing track prep. But usually there's a lot of fans and stuff like that. That's, that's the cool thing about dirt racing. It's so accessible to the fans just in general. So if you come to a race where he's at or a Schrader, you know, if they're out about, they want you to come and say hi, get an autograph or whatever. So it's pretty neat. Some of the drivers aren't quite so accessible. Kenny's got quite a few guys on his crew, which is not typical of your uh, your average everyday weekend driver. He's got several people that crew for him. Uh, souvenir trailer and his wife, Kim, is going to be manning that tonight. Kenny's here wiping off this uh, Granite City dirt. Is yeah, that what it is? we was here at, uh, you know, we run fourth last night up there at Granite City. Michael Long won, Matt Meavert second, Kinder third, I was fourth. Tough battle, you know, with Dean Hoffman, one of the best in the United States. Yeah. But uh, yeah, my crew chief, Billy Smith, you know, his wife had a baby. Mm -hmm. So my leader is down, so I got to get in here and I need to go back to old school. So. Uh, <laughs> You know, I, I, me and, of course, my brother, Rusty Wallace, and Mike, we've all built our own cars, so, you know, we haven't forgot. So you, you got to get a win tonight to uh, dedicate to the baby, right? I hope so, but you, know, but, you know, some of the best in the United States are here at Western Kentucky. You know, I, I know this is one of the best tracks in the world, and uh, I know all the big boys run here, so I'll have my work cut out for me. All right. We'll see if I can. <laughs> Top five is a big deal, you know. <laughs> I'll come back a little bit later with my good camera and get an interview. Awesome, buddy. Thanks. So.
so he even uh, he's pretty hands on with his own car, his own equipment, even though he does have uh, quite a few guys, which like I said, you don't really see mod guys that have uh, a tire guy. So I try to show you guys some grinding and all that kind of stuff each week, so. And uh, like I said, he doesn't have an exotic toter home. They, uh, they race pretty close to home most of the time, just drive in and then uh, later in the summer he'll have his uh, NASCAR deal going on to where he has to uh, schedule around that as well. So try to catch with him and get a, an actual interview with him and uh, I don't know, just hang out around those guys. He's pretty busy all the time, so and not knowing him very well or at all. So here we go. So uh, getting a couple interviews on this rig again, driving around getting some of the mod drivers. And uh, not a big car count here tonight for mods. Um, that's a thousand to win. Um, but in this area, we've got a lot of tracks that compete against each other on every Saturday night. So um, it's still early in the, in the year, so people are trying to make their plans and figure out where they're going to race and everything. But uh, we'll uh, get a couple more interviews and get those posted up. And uh, like I've been telling these guys, and Tell the tracks I go to. You know, I don't make any money off doing this. It's just kind of fun for me. But uh, just trying to promote short track uh, grassroots racing in this area and give uh, people who have fans uh, something to see throughout the week and uh, just generate interest. So um, we'll try to get a couple more interviews before the night's over. I haven't gotten Kenny Wallace yet, although in this I got him goofing around, but. Uh, get another interview with him and then uh, racing action so hope you guys enjoy so if you're watching this you've probably already watched uh, my race footage and stuff like that since this is usually the last thing I can put up but um, asked Kenny Wallace about putting a GoPro on his car I said shoot yeah man go for it so uh, put one in on the roll cage facing right in on the car um, so you can actually watch him drive so figure you can go on YouTube anywhere Hot lab session over now. Now and find videos of the cruiser division here Kenny Wallace's car going around in circles with actually watching him drive. It's something a little bit different. So hopefully you guys enjoy that. We're getting ready to uh, hot lap and qualify here in a second. And then uh, they'll get straight into heat racing. Qualifying uh, just concluded. Hot lap still underway for the other classes. And I'm going to try grabbing uh, probably two more interviews. Um, you get posted up. I still got some I haven't uploaded yet. Uh, clear bar, clear far as back as the Toilet Bowl Classic uh, that I'm kind of sitting on, waiting for a rainy week. Uh, if we have a total rain out to be able to uh, upload some content. So here's a body that Tyler nicely made. TNR body on a cruiser class car, I believe. But a lot of, uh, like I said, a lot of competing races going on in, in, in this region um, with the various big shows going on. So eight mods, uh, final count. Randall Sweeney's here. Uh, he's a regional favorite. Uh, I think he co-set fast time with Kenny Wallace, but uh, looked like he tore, tore the rear end up. So um, those guys will be thrashing to get the spoiler put back on. and. Um, fender straightened out so I'll try to make it down there to show some of that here in a minute yeah. line up for heat rates right now I think uh, nine total cars I saw another one rolled in so um, I'm not gonna video the heat race action but I'm gonna get the features so um, but I will have Kenny Wallace's uh, in-car view so that should be pretty good hopefully my GoPro stays on, I got to um, zip tied in there to make sure it stays in. So. If 
you haven't watched my uh, unboxing of uh, Alan Sturt the game, check it out. Um, those guys are going to come on board and help us out a little bit. And so hopefully we'll have some uh, giveaways for uh, some uh, Alan Sturt the Games through race day vlogs. And uh, check them out. Fun game. It's pretty cheap, it's only like 20 bucks. Uh, Dirt-thegame.com, check them out. So Kenny Wallace is coming out on the track during intermission right now, and they're doing a pretty neat, neat little promotion. Uh, they've got a junior fan club here for little kids, and if you entered it, they're gonna have a drawing for uh, one kid who gets to take a lap around the track with uh, Kenny Wallace. So pretty neat little promotion. I know a lot of tracks used to do that back in the day, especially before um, the days of the wedges and the late models that we know today. Um, Earl Hill, who uh, drove for my uncle a long, long time ago. Uh, I've talked to several people who uh, were lucky enough to get it to uh, do a ride along with him. My uh, sister and my cousin both got to ride in the car. So pretty, pretty neat experience for a kid and uh, especially NASCAR's Kenny Wallace. And also, I'll let you know that the rest of the drivers here are some of the best. You know that Kentucky is home of Lawson, Oakdale, Kentucky. So uh, we all know, we all know who's who. And I want to thank you all for coming out here. I appreciate you. I was born racing, I've been a racing family. And when you fans go up to a race track like this, it makes me feel good. I want to thank you all for coming out tonight. All right, so headed home. Got most of the features. Uh, just didn't do, uh, I think the bomber class, my battery was getting low and they uh, only had like three cars in their class. So, didn't do that. Um, yeah, uh, didn't do a whole lot of vlogging today just because I didn't know, really didn't know any of the drivers um, personally. So, it makes it a little bit harder to vlog and talk to people and stuff like that. But, uh, Got to meet uh, Kenny Wallace and uh, hopefully got some good footage off of him, especially with the uh, in-car stuff. So, um, not sure exactly what I'm going to do next week. Uh, tentatively planning to go to Cedar Ridge Speedway in Morgantown, Kentucky. And uh, haven't been there yet this year. It's kind of my local track to where I live in Bowling Green, Kentucky. So, uh, but impressions of uh, Western Kentucky Speedway, Nebo, Kentucky. Uh, great racing um really was can't wait till later in the summer they have the, a couple 5,000 to win american modified series races and those should be really good shows um so if you're ever in the uh western kentucky area madisonville area on a saturday night uh check out their schedule and see what they got going on uh you may want to come out and check out some racing here um but uh yeah randall sweeney Kenny Wallace put on a heck of a show. Uh, Kenny actually saying that his uh, he accidentally hit the kill switch on his car when he was trying to adjust the brakes. He had a pretty comfortable lead uh, up until then. And then uh, he just came from the tail and all the way through. So he and uh, Randall had a pretty good battle going on. And uh, Randall's kind of a lot more of the, Randall Sweeney is kind of a lot of the local heroes, uh, very well-known racer. He's had a pretty good career, so the two of them put on a pretty good show. So um, I'll definitely look forward to coming back there this uh, later in the summer. I think in July is when they have that uh, AMS show. So we'll be there then. So I uh, hope you guys are liking what we're doing here. I know today is a little bit different, and um, but we'll get up the interviews that we got and uh, the racing footage and all that. So. Uh, if you haven't done so already, hit the subscribe button down below. Um, go ahead and like this video, share it, uh, like our fan or uh, like our Facebook page, and uh, we'll be doing some cool giveaways uh, coming up pretty soon. And uh, also getting some drivers involved for a driver giveaway very soon. So we'll uh, see you next time, and it's uh, time to head to the house.